12 local headlines from EPB. This is the place for the latest news from around the Tennessee Valley and North Georgia. Good afternoon, I'm Amelia Greer with a look at your News 12 headlines. The man charged with the murder of a 22-year-old Chattanooga woman was back in court this morning. The last time Jason Chen was in court, his defense attorney Joshua Weiss made the argument that the searches of his apartment by the Pace family and Chattanooga police while they were searching for the then missing Jasmine Pace was unconstitutional. Hamilton County Judge Boyd Patterson has ruled against Chen's request. He wrote in an 11 page opinion that six different searches between November 2022 and January 2023 did not violate the unreasonable search and seizure clause of the Fourth Amendment. This means all evidence gained from those searches inside of Chin's apartment are still eligible for use in the upcoming murder trial. However, Weiss is already implicating that he will appeal this decision to a state court, which led Hamilton County District Attorney Cody Womp to issue this on the record. Based on our trial strategy and how we are preparing thus far, we do not intend to use any evidence that was gained from the search that the patrol officers at the Chattanooga Police Department performed on Mr. Chen's apartment. That would include their testimony and any body cam footage gathered from that search. Uh, we believe that's important for appellate purposes for the Court of Appeals to know that. Weiss did also indicate that he has more pre-trial motions he wants to Judge Patterson to consider, so the trial date has been pushed back to the beginning of next year. That's a look at one of today's top stories. I'm Amelia Greer. You're watching News 12.